Hello, hello, this is David Lundgren at the Digital Design Center. Today we're going to be uh, showing you a quick video on communication with the LinkedIn system. It's called LinMail Pro. I was going to do this anyway, so I thought I'd hit the record button and uh, show you some details. Now, what we're doing here, this list of names, these are the connections that are coming in since yesterday. So you can see, you know, people have hit my profile, my LinkedIn profile. Uh, they, they've searched me out by keywords and they've uh, added me as a connection. And you can see the constant flow of people coming in from my system. So the next question is, is how do you communicate? How do you stay in touch? Uh, and the, the best thing you can do is, you know, send them a quick message, what I call a welcome aboard. And you can see I'm just flowing in here. This happens on a daily basis. And now as the, as uh, this recording, I'm uh, almost at 23,000 first level connections and over 100 million network connections. So this is a program called Lin Mail Pro. So I'm gonna show you a couple of things before I, I didn't wanna kinda of get it all sanitized and delete everything so I can show you. But see right here, it's not gonna to send to these people because it's already duplicated within the list below. So, so you can just click X and gets rid of them. This area right here is for scraping. I'll show you that in a bit. And what we're gonna do, this is the most important part. Now you can do everything I'm showing you manually. You know, put them in a tag. A tag is simply like a folder. So I'm gonna go up here and tag it in connection new. And you can see right there, it's tag. So I can untag or I can tag. So when I send a message out, it's actually putting a copy of their, uh, you know, their name, well, you know, in their record called connection new. So that's building a folder for me that I can broadcast to that folder at a later time. So right here is the message. You're gonna say, well, what message? Well, I've already got it done. I'm going to right click and I'm going to paste. There is my welcome aboard message. And you can see right here, Tuesday, September 6. Good evening, first name. Here's the first name tag right there. And that's like a mail merge. It's going to take Lloyd, pop it in there. And to see actually how it's going to look as a preview, I simply click outside the box. And you can see right there, good evening, Lloyd. So we're ready to go. The message is there. Uh, that's all there is to it. I'm going to go ahead and you can see right, uh, we're going to set it here just to, to maybe 40 just for this video. And let me set that here real quick. And uh, all we do is we check to make sure the program is running. It is. And you can see right here, is the widget running? Yes, it is. So this is how simple it is. This little paper airplane, that's the Lin Mail Pro icon. And all we're going to do is click it. So let's get ready to go. Click. And you can see right here, we have a window. Normally, I just let that be minimized. But let me show you exactly what's going on so you can see it. So it's opening up the record. It's inserting my letter, welcome aboard letter. You can see it's personalizing it. Good evening, Lloyd. It's going to automatically hit the send button. Okay, even though you see action going on, that's not me. That's the LinMail Pro system automatically doing this. So now we're on to the next record. And you can see right over here, a little secret, loaded, waiting. So it's loaded the next one and it's waiting 20 or so, 25 seconds. So it normally ranges anywhere from 15 to 30 seconds, just to kind of give it a little randomness so it doesn't overload the system. And this is all running in the background. So you want to take a lunch break, uh, an evening uh, dinner break, you want to do this overnight, you can set this up on autopilot and it will automatically go ahead and send out personalized letters to your new connections, your a team, you know, a newsletter, and uh, you can set this up in folders, and that's what I do. And uh, while this is running a little bit, go ahead and write this down. I'm not going to interrupt this to show you, but you can just go to freedemo.center, 
I'm going to minimize this real quick, real quick. Okay, free demo dot center, F R E E D E M O dot C E N T E R, free demo cent dot center. On the top main video, you're going to see a video showing exactly what I'm showing you here, but it's also going to show you how to tag. Tag is how to set up tags, how to organize your groups. You know, and you want to do this from day one. You don't want to let this where you have thousands of connections and then you go, oh man, I wish I would have listened to David Lundgren and organize my tags, my folders. Please listen to me. Do it from day one. Or at least on an ongoing basis if you've already got a few hundred, few thousand, catch up. But what you, what you can do is with this program, you can automatically send a message to a folder. And that becomes a huge time saver. So what I'm going to do right now is show you, uh, you can see what's happening right here. Now we've only done a few of them and uh, maybe five, but you know, whether you're doing five or 50 or 500 or, you know, whatever the number, I wanted to show you the program is also doing something behind the scenes. It's scraping the information from the LinkedIn profile as well as sending out the customized letter. It's giving me access to their name their you know success just means it's finished the title it's pulling at from the linkedin profile the company that they are representing the location the industry the education uh, email phone number uh, profile link and then see right here it's it's adding the tag connection new and then right over here first name last name now why this is important is because right up here you can go and put in a file name you know when this is done when you're ready and you can save it as like test one two three dot CSV well that's what that's gonna do is allow you to export you know the information right into an external email broadcasting software so now you can communicate in mass uh, via email instead of just internally uh, within the LinkedIn system. So being able to scrape all that data, pop it in there and have it automatically removed uh, duplicates, things like that, it's very valuable. And you can see I'm not gonna, I'm gonna end the recording now uh, because this is just gonna continue. You can see we've got uh, you know a ways to go here, but it's the same, well, like I said, whether you're doing 550 or 500. And uh, what I would do is just come down here to watch it and uh, come over here and so like I said this is all running in the background of uh, it's a time saver you know let me trust me when I say this whenever you can automate and save time automate the process do it you know this is a very low cost uh, piece of software it's a Chrome browser extension you'll notice that I'm not having to import export files like a lot of company a lot of other programs do uh, but what I do tell people I've said this for decades you know if you're not building a list you're talking to yourself so hopefully this has helped you made you know make yourself a little bit more dangerous and see what you can do to make your life a little bit more easier and save time using the LinkedIn system Hope you've learned enough to be dangerous. Have a great day. David Lundgren at the Digital Design Center.